Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Good morning. Come on in. Come on in. <clears throat> this is not a live. I have to upload this, this video because I'm running late. And I wanted to get a video in for you guys this morning. It is Friday. And we will be doing 10, count them, 10 free readings today. The first 10. So make sure you guys get in early. Cause I don't know why. Um, those 10 slots are going to go really, really fast. And after that, it's going to be paid. Okay. It's going to be paid readings after that. Um, but we gonna we had great conversation yesterday. Great. I said we just chit chatted. Um, didn't do too much readings. I think I did two or three. And um, but we had great conversation. Great guest. We had shout out to King Leaks. King, nice young man. Nice uh, up front. Real. So I hope I, he. I hope I see him on here today. Um. We got a lot of snow here in Chicago today. Woke up, snow covered the car all over the driveway. Right again, right now, all over the streets. So, um, yeah, it's crazy. I got to take the kids to work today. Um, when I get, I'm not for sure. I think they may have to get be there before I get off work. So they may have to take over. And then I may have to pick them up. But um, either way, we are going to do free readings th uh, today. Um, starting at, I'm, I want to try to get started by 7. That's what I want to do. I want to try to get started by 7. And then... Um, Y'all be safe and be careful. If it's if it's snowing where you are, slippery, slushy. I didn't even wear my boots. I got gym shoes on, and literally, I should have wore my boots. Um, cause the boots, your boots have more traction in the snow, and um, it's if the people has not put salt. This is the only thing that, um, when it comes to the eyes, you know, maintenance. When they have to, every time this happens, they have to get out there at like six seven in the morning they have to get out there and it's shovel i mean not sh well they have to shovel the um uh, the sidewalks and then we have a company that comes and does the, the the streets and the, and the parking spaces um but they have to shovel and remove snow from the sidewalks and then they have to put the salt down so That's the only thing about maintenance, especially in the wintertime. I don't envy that summertime, you can do this shit, no problem. Wintertime, who wants to be out here in the winter do, shoveling, doing this shit, especially if it's cold, you know? Who wants to do I know I don't. But anyway, today is going to be a good day. I'm speaking into existence. Today is going to be a good day. A great day. A positive day. So today is our dress down day. Dress down Friday. So I, I got my Tarot shirt on. It says Tarot card reader. Um, so I'm going to have this on all day today. And um, I'm going to be ready. I hope y'all be ready. Y'all know we always have. When I say we're going to have some good readings. And it's going to make you go ah. And and, and it's going to get real interesting. I, I promise you it does every single time. Every single time. So y'all better y'all tune in. If you're not so sure about it and how it goes, just tune in. Tune in and watch. Tune in and listen. And then see if it's something you might be interested in. And start off light. Start off lightly. Usually I get those that says <clears throat> to me, 
Miss Gina, I want a general reading. And I'll give them a general reading. And it wind up being the best general reading um, that they could have ever had. So start off. You don't have to go in deep. You don't have to, you know, uh, sometimes it does get deep. A lot of times it does get deep, but you can start off slow. You can start off with a general reading, um, or you could say, uh, "I just got one question," and you could, and it could be a lighthearted question. You know, um, I just started a new job, and is this gonna be for me, or you know, what's the outcome? New job. Something lighthearted like that, and then you can see where it goes. Then once you get the feel, which is usually what someone does, they'll start off, especially if they've never done it, start off with something lighthearted, light, get the feel, and then they'll just go from there. So that's what you can do. I know one thing. I hope it, look, I, which I know, I, it's, it's, I'm, my desk is right by the window. So I get the feel of all the, the, the air that comes through the window. But I did go back across the street to the old office and get a heater. Because I have a heater. And I did go and do that. So I was pretty warm yesterday. But the second I turned that heater off, you guys, <clears throat> I was colder than a mug. I was just like, what? in the dickens where that cold air come from but it was almost time to go so I already know it's going to be old I'm going to turn my, my heater on it says Chicago weather alert dangerous drive Just that, that just came across my phone Chicago weather alert dangerous. and then you know in the, in, the, in the set about it is you get a lot of people that cannot drive in this weather. You get a lot of people that not only can they not drive in this weather, you got other dummies, other dummies that will speed thinking they got, you know, good traction and good tire. I don't care. I give a damn how good your tires are. If you got this black ice, if you are on this black ice, You will still slide your ass into somebody. So, you have to be very careful. It was that. So y'all be careful out here. Be very careful. You know, drive it. No matter where you at, just be careful. Drive for you. Drive for the other people. Honey, make sure you ask God to pray over you and pray over your vehicle. Say, honey, Jesus be a shield. Say, Jesus be a shield, honey, because these folks drives crazy. Happiness is pets. It's pets. I want to go in there. I got to I want to go. Well, I need to go to a I was online last night looking at kittens cuz Farron really wants a kitten. And um so I was looking at him looking for a little kitten for Farron. And uh, he deserved it. He really really like it. So I want to get him a cute little kitten. And I know it when I see it. But I wanted us to adopt one. So I've been online and I've been looking. So if you guys know anybody <laughs> that live, if, and you live in Chicago or any of the suburbs in Chicago, let please let me know. You know, your cat may have had kittens, or you know somebody's cat that may have had kittens. We want a kitten, not a cat. I want I want someone that that can uh, something that my son can bond with. You know what I'm saying? Not these cats that got their own personalities, and then they you know they feel some type of way, and then they be scratching and attacking my baby. Uh uh. I want him to have a cute little kitten 
that he can bond with and um <clears throat> and I think it would it would it would definitely I remember my daughter's when he was around my daughter's cat and it helped a lot with his disability and um and animals do help a lot with therapy and stuff like that and he takes really good care of Zoe but <clears throat> he always says my I love Zoe but I'd rather have a cat <laughs> he always says that so I know that he'll, he's going to take great care of the cat. We have a big, beautiful house, nice backyard. Um, Aaron has a nice size bedroom. So he'll be able to, you know, keep his cat um, in his room. And um, and he'll be able to, you know, keep the, the kitty litter in the bathroom, in the boys' bathroom. Or even in uh, um um even in the section of the hallway, he could do that if he wanted to. So, and I want to get him one of them in clothes. I I seen where they got the kitty litter where they go in when they come out. It changes the thing, and they don't have you don't have to worry about them uh tracking the the, the, the kitty litter all outside of it. you guys I am here at work and I should see you all this evening y'all have a lovely blessful day I love you guys and um ta-ta for now